This is our long closeout drill. So many times in basketball, you end up in rotation and closeout situations. Oftentimes, you've got to come from a long ways away. So we've already established the footwork that we need on a short closeout. On a long closeout, we have a little bit different mentality and even a greater sense of urgency because we've got to cover more ground. As Chekna is under the goal with the basketball on a long closeout, he needs to make sure that he does a great job, a great job with his first two steps. So how we're going to start this drill, uh, he won't throw it right now, but he'll throw the ball out. And what you want to watch is that he pushes off his inside foot. It's so important to push off that inside leg to get that drive on that first step. It's like stealing a base in baseball. If you get a good jump, you have a great chance to steal a base. Well, the same thing is true here on the long closeout. If he does a great job, I want him to have it go where he throws the ball first and then he starts his movement and he's going to push off his inside foot then that foot's going to go first after he goes his first two steps to steal the base now we're right back into our short closeout butt down feet are chopping two hands high here we go long closeout good go back again We'll give him one more. Again, with the long closeout, he has to have, once the ball is in the air, he has to have a tremendous sense of urgency, pushing off the inside foot, stepping first with the outside foot. Here we go. Good. All right. And even on that closeout right there, you see the adjustment check they made at the end of the closeout. We want to always make sure that we maintain that relationship to the basketball, taking away the rhythm shot, and then with the mentality to guard the dribble.